Thoracic and Core Anatomy 101. Starting with lung anatomy, on the left lung there are two lobes here, and then you can see the right lung has three lobes, three different sections to the lung. Interesting fact that a lot of people do not know, your lungs actually come above your clavicle, meaning higher than the clavicle. In between the lungs is the heart. The bottom of the heart is the ventricles, the top is the atria. We have the left ventricle, right ventricle, left atrium, right atrium. This pink area is gonna be your pulmonary artery, your pulmonary trunk. The little yellow pieces are just a little bit of fat, and then the red going down in between the yellow is going to be some of your coronary arteries, specifically your LAD. The red arch is going to be the aortic arch, and then the blue coming up and splitting, that is your superior vena cava. I have fat on my heart, are you kidding me? Coming off of the aortic arch here, we have the left subclavian artery, and then we have the left common carotid artery. Coming off this side is the right common carotid, and then the right subclavian is gonna come off of that. That's not shown here. With the superior vena cava here, the blue, it's gonna branch off into the left brachiocephalic artery, and then the right brachiocephalic this way. Underneath all of that, we have on the left side, the more superficial musculature. On the right side, we have the diaphragm. This little hole right here is the hiatus. That is gonna be where your inferior vena cava is gonna come through the diaphragm below the heart. We have the rectus abdominis muscle here. We have your external obliques running this way. And then these little knife pieces are the serratus anterior. How do you do that? 